I'm at Jonathan Dixon State Park just south of Port St. Lucie. And this state park in Florida has something that I don't think any of the other state parks have. And I want to show you what that is. So I've probably been to uh, 12 or 15 Florida state parks. And for camping, the one thing I have never seen is this right there. It's got sewer. Stick around for the rest of the video. This is going to be a good one. Okay, like other Florida state parks, you've got the gravel drive here, picnic table, a barbecue, and a fire pit. We have uh, 50 and 30 amp electric, have water, and of course I've already shown you the sewer hookup, which is uh, very remarkable. No cable TV. I haven't tried the TV channels yet to see uh, what kind of channels we get coming out of Port St. Lucie. I think we are about 18 miles south. This park is situated on US-1, which is very near to the intercoastal waterway and then a barrier island out there. might be sea grapes but this is June of 2020 the park has been refurbished the utilities have been upgraded and uh, the only thing that's really missing here is shade but you can't expect much of that in this part of the state this close to the beach but the park has a wonderful uh, bathhouse down there where you see the flag flying and we're going to go around and check some of the sites i'm hoping to see an alligator Two loops and each loop has a bathhouse and they all look just about the same. Well, one thing right off the bat I see that's different is there's no sewer connection here at these campsites. And coming right through the park is the Loxahatchee River, which unfortunately the swimming area is closed today. I think they've got some construction going on. But in typical times, you can uh, swim here. There's people fishing over there right now. And here, there's a bathhouse. There's a lot of facilities here. This is what's called gator culvert. And there are some alligators in there. There's one's head sticking up right there.
going up in the observation tower. Nice breeze up here today. And the top. This is a large state park. But from this vantage point here, you can see the intercoastal waterway and then one of the barrier islands. And just beyond that is the Atlantic Ocean. Beautiful. So the sign said a 10 minute walk up here. You can get up here at easily in 10 minutes. About a 10 minute drive from the state park is this Coral Cove Park, which is on the Atlantic side. So let's go take a look at the beach. <laughs> 